I don't understand all that it is you're going through, but don't ever do that again. Do you realize how embarrassing that was for me? I didn't know where you'd gone. I was left standing there like a fool, making excuses. What would you tell everybody? I told them you're not good at handling shows of affection. So don't be expecting any for a while. <laughs> I just couldn't take it anymore. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to make it uncomfortable for you. How'd you get home? Luther brought me. Would have been here sooner, except he wanted to stop the frozen yogurt. <laughs> what are you doing? Watching old game films. What for? I don't know. Uh, maybe they'd try and make some sense out of all this. I, man, I thought losing was tough. This winning is driving me crazy. <laughs> yeah, see, there's a tackle. What game is this? It was the best game I ever coached. We were playing Notre Dame in South Bend. They were ranked number one that year. I never had a team of mine play more perfectly than this one that day. Look, Hayden, I'm sure it's more satisfying to win a game like that one than the one you won today. We didn't win this game. You didn't? No, nope, got beat by a field goal last minute. And that was your most perfect game? We played great, they played better, the best team won. That's the way sports are supposed to be. These last four weeks, Christine, the better team has lost. It defies all football logic. I mean, it's, it's out of control, honey. It's just a lucky streak, Hayden. No, no, it's more than that, Christine. You don't beat teams like Florida and Wisconsin on, on just luck. Then what do you think it is? Seriously? I think the planets are out of whack. <laughs> or maybe I'm out of whack. I don't know. I just wish I felt like we deserve this. Why don't you think you do? Haven't you lost games that you thought you deserved to win? Yeah, sure. Well, then maybe this is payback for all of those. Maybe fate is balancing the scales. Let's see, if it's fate, honey, then what the hell is my job? I'm a teacher. I've been... I've been teaching for 27 years that you win football games by, by being committed, by being focused, by being prepared. Well, none of that seems to apply anymore. These kids are winning because they, they screw up a snap from center on a field goal attempt and they end up throwing a touchdown. They, they, they win because Florida gets called for two stupid penalties. They win because a 320-pound a lineman who hasn't run 50 yards in his whole damn life, picks up a fumble and rumbles for 80 yards and a touchdown. You said yourself it's going to end, right? I mean, whether it's next week or the week after, the breaks are going to start to go the other way. And when they do, these kids aren't going to understand why. They're going to need you to explain to them that that's the way life works. You can't be lucky all the time. But what if you can? What do you mean? I mean, what if the breaks go our way? What if we don't lose next week or the week after? Well, Hayden, if the team never loses, then... Then we'd be on one hell of a ride. Oh, God, what if we had one of those miracle teams, Christine? Well, then I'd say fate figures it owes you big time. And I'd try to enjoy it. Because it's a ride very few get to take. Now, why don't you come to bed? It's been a long day. Yeah, maybe you're right. I'm exhausted. Besides, you're gonna need your rest playing Alabama next week.